In a previous video, I showed you how to use Excel to diagram the payoff for an option strategy known as a straddle. And I'm going to extend that by showing you another couple of strategies here. So a straddle is the case where you think that the stock price is going to move a lot, but you're not sure in which direction. It could go up or it could go down. And the example I gave previously was a small pharmaceutical company that has uh, put all of its resources into some sort of cancer therapy. If it receives FDA approval, the price of the stock is likely to go through the roof. If, the, if it does not receive approval, the company is likely bankrupt. So what do you do there? Well, when you buy a call option, you're betting on the price of the stock going up because you can buy at the exercise price regardless of what the actual price is. When you buy a put option, you're betting on the price going down regardless of what the price is because you can sell at the exercise price. So if you think that the stock price is going to make a big move but you don't know in which direction, you can buy a put and a call option with the same exercise price. Now, here's a modification of that. The long strap. So this is similar to a straddle except when you think it's more likely the price will rise, why don't you use two call options for every one put you buy? So in this case, so here I have, I have the same payoffs I had from the uh, previous video for the long put and the long call, and the payoff here for the strap is two times the value of the call plus the value of the put. And if you look at the diagram here, it's steeper on the upside because you're making a bet that the price is going to go up faster. What's the cost of this strategy? The cost is you're buying two of these, two of these calls, so that's six dollars, plus you're buying one put, that's eight dollars. So um, you have an eight dollar cost here. Now, if the price is going down, the price has to fall by a full $8 for you to break even. So the strike price is 20 so it has to fall by $8 down to 12 On the other hand, because you have two call options, for every dollar it goes above the exercise price, you make $2. So the break even is not, you don't have to go up eight dollars you only have to go up four dollars so the break even over here is twenty four and you can see it goes up much faster it's steeper here it's twice as steep as this one here so again you don't want to you know some of you might think well if you're gonna buy two calls for every put why don't you just buy one call but then you don't make any money should the price of the stock collapse so you still got a bet on the downside but you think the upside is much more likely let me show you the, the alternative, which is referred to as a strip. So again, similar to a straddle, except you think it's more likely the price will fall, so you're going to buy two puts for every one call option you buy. And again, if we look at the graph, we can see it's steeper when it's going down and flatter when the stock price is going up. And again, how much is this strategy? Well, now you're buying two puts, so that's $4 plus the $3 cost, so that's a $7 cost. So the strike price here is 20, so that means that going up, it has to rise by $7 to break even, so the break even is 27 here. But on the downside, for every dollar it goes below 20, you're making $2 because you have two put options, so it only has to fall by $3.50. So Six, 1650 is going to be the break even here. So it's going up much faster here. So again, this is another interesting strategy that you can employ using options, right? There's no rule that says it has to be one to one. It can be two to one. For that matter, it could be three to one or three to two. There are a lot of different um, strategies you can have. They don't all necessarily have names because obviously there's an infinite amount of 
of uh, ratios you could have, three to two, you know, um, five to four, et cetera, et cetera. But in this case, um, the strip is the one where you use two puts and one call, and the strap is the one where you use two calls for every one put. And again, you draw the payoff diagram, and you simply add these up, but here you're going to have the value of the call at each price plus two times the value of the put at the price. And you can see the payoffs here in this um, diagram. So again, if you want to draw these, again, highlight the cells, go up to insert, and works well when you choose recommended graph and then you know you may have to scroll through here to find what is the appropriate graph here they have you know bar graph and some other kinds of graphs but this is the one that we've chosen I'm just gonna cancel because I already have it here but again you can see that this creates um, a unique payoff that can be quite beneficial um, quite a beneficial way of making a bet on the price of a stock.